Okay, the first of the Tolkien books has arrived. I'm going to unpack them here. This is a package from Belgium, which means it's also these are also going to be the nicest Tolkien books that I've ordered. Collector's editions. Still waiting on the Amazon books. Should be here this week, hopefully. I'm a little worried because some of them should have come in last week. Right, they are well packed up. Oh, box in a box. Ah, there we go. <laughs> I uh, received these books from Peter Collier, who is uh, a Tolkien collector and he also a reseller. I'm going to open this. Jeez, it's well packed. <laughs> um, and this is the original box he received them in. By the looks of it, he hasn't actually opened them. See, okay, I'm gonna attack from this side, I think. To be a bit careful. I don't want to damage what's inside, of course. Very nice. Let's see if I can carefully coax these out of the box. Look at this two over. There we go. <laughs> Talkinglibrary.com. And this is it. The Hobbit, Lord of the Rings, the Silmarillion, and the Children of Hurin. Or Hurin, I'm not sure how you pronounce that yet. So, this is supposedly a 500 edition limited run. These are special prints of these books. Now, if you were a real collector, you'd buy two of these and keep one in plastic. But I'm not a real collector, and these are for reading. So, let's very carefully get them out of the plastic. Now I've bought these, and they were expensive, I've bought these with the understanding that I would not have to buy another set of these books ever again. These will last me my lifetime, and hopefully I can pass these on if I keep them in proper condition. A little bit dusty, that's a shame. A little bit marked from the plastic, but that's okay. The eye, lidless, wreathed in flame. This is a Actually, it's um, cut out of the cardboard there, it's quite nice. Lord of the Rings 50th Anniversary Edition. I'll, um, I might type up the text of this um, in the uh, comments for the, for the blog post. Don't know if you can read that. Yeah, I'll uh, stick that in the post later. But uh, suffice to say, it's... Um, 
fully reset special edition um, original red and black maps drawn by Christopher Tolkien are included. Um, additional Hobbit family trees are included. Now, how do you get the book out? <laughs> by the way, these are published by HarperCollins, and HarperCollins publishes the best uh, Tolkien uh, books. Um, come on. <laughs> quite stuck. Oh, there we go. It's coming. Needed a little nudge. I don't want to pull it by the, the top there, because I'll I'll damage it, but I might have to because it's not actually coming out. Oh, it's slowly shifting, very slowly. Ah, there we are. Oh, it's a huge book. <laughs> wow, look at that. Isn't that beautiful? Books don't get more proper than this. Wonderful. Paper is bright white, <laughs> very white. <laughs> ah, here are the maps. And I can see the. Uh, this is where the. Uh, They've got some artwork inserted, which is fold out, I believe. Very careful. Leaves from the book of Mazabul. That's, um, I think that's dwarvish writing. So there's additional colour art in here. Quite, very nice. Let's have a look. Oh, there's a fold out map here. Ah, this is the large page version. This is uh, mostly Gondor and uh, Mordor on the right. Right, running out of time on the YouTube video. Going to be ten minutes, so a quick look at the other ones. The Hobbit, again, deluxe edition, 16-page introduction by Christopher Tolkien. Um, Tolkien's original artwork included. Again, that little cutout thing here. I won't open that now. And we have 